Dubai at Half Desert. We're going to perform some repeat acceleration tests and enthusiastic driving tests, trying to put the car under some extreme load, both on the battery and on the motors. One, go. We've done a lot of testing on the hardware so far, and we've proven that the hardware can achieve what we want to achieve, and now it's all about tuning the software to get the thermal management system as refined as possible. Just gonna make sure that we trigger the active battery cooling. That will make it more interesting when we do the repeater accelerations, because then we will be more in the real balancing. So yeah, I'm good to go. Good to go. The tests in the desert give us that controlled environment where we can perform those repeat accelerations on a closed road. Zero to 100 to zero. Yeah, let's go for a zero to 100. I think we have enough road to do that, so it shouldn't be a problem. Okay, are we good to go? Ready to start repeat axle test. Road clear, over. So three, two, one, go. It's good. <laughs> I think the, the acceleration is nothing to complain on, I would say. <laughs> it would be interesting for me to get two accelerations a little bit tighter in between. Yeah, three, two, one, go. doing this so we can ensure that the vehicle's thermal management system can keep the battery and the motors and the cabin cool in these harsh conditions. At Jebel Jace we're then able to put those kind of simulated tests into practice with a, a real world use case of driving enthusiastically on a mountain road. We'll see how, depending on the road, how aggressive we can go, but quite aggressive. Coming to Dubai has given us the opportunity to tune the vehicle's thermal management software so that we can ensure that it responds to customers' requests for high torque when they're driving enthusiastically. And it turned out really well. We were able to perform the tests at Jebel Jason, keep both the, the battery and the vehicle motors under control.